Okay, so it's a beautiful, glorious summer's, summer's evening and it's June the 21st and I'm off to meet the ancestors. I'm going to make the pilgrimage and um, get up there close to the gods and see if I can give some offering. Um, yeah, okay, it's quite a hike. Okay, well, I've arrived at the lay-by and um, I'll get walking. It's eight o'clock at night and the sun is absolutely glorious and it's absolutely baking hot still. So, um, yeah, I've got loads of time to get up there. It's going to take me about 40, 50 minutes and it's all uphill. See you soon. Yep, there's the car. I haven't got very far maybe about 20 paces um, but I've just got a bit over faced by what's ahead of me which is all that so yeah I can't say I'm looking forward to it actually but the hardest part is taking the first steps so um, I'll, I'll just carry on yeah so um, that's where I've been it wasn't that hard really and then I've got to go up there now Yep. So, uh, off we go. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. I think the fear of it is often worse than just actually doing it. So I've reached that point now and um, I've got to go right to the top of a, a hill over there. So um, I'll probably tune in when I get to the top of the hill. Uh, the flies and aren't so bad today. Uh, yesterday, um, or a couple of days ago, I went out. It was very, very hot. And the insects, they, they don't really mention that when they uh, show you lovely pictures of the countryside. But some of the biting insects in the grass are just, oh, they're horrible. And I was only, I uh, stood there uh, for about maybe a couple of, not even a couple of minutes. I only just got there and I was bitten like harshly three times. And I had to come back because, um, you know, I was just I was just getting um, bullied by horse flies. Anyway, I will show you some of the countryside, and next time I will tune in when I'm at the top of that hill. There you go, top of that one. I've just walked from the tree over there. I'm not at the top of the hill yet. Those two um, mounds there by the tree. And that used to be, I'm pretty sure, um, I've got no no way of knowing really, but um, I think that, that used to be some kind of a, a stone quarrying exercise or enterprise. Yeah, it's just a changing landscape of, of the earth, what used to happen. Um, you know, everything moves on and changes. So yeah, the path, midges, boots. Okay, so um, not far for me to go now. The um, hill at the back of me. I don't know if you can see it up there. That's where I have to go now. I've done the hard yards, so it's not so far to go. Um, absolutely beautiful. It's probably about half past eight at night now, and um, the sun is still really quite strong. I can see for miles and miles and miles up here. The air is so nice and fresh. I'm glad that I came. Okay, the stone circle is somewhere buried beneath the grass, which I'm going to in a minute. Very bright sun. It's Winter Hill. Yeah, a Bolton. There's a trig point. That's 
Manchester and Derbyshire in the background. God knows where that is. Okay, so I'm sat on my uh, favourite stone. So let's get out my uh, meagre offerings to the summer solstice. So I have brought with me two daisies from my garden. From my garden to this garden. And Okay, well, I think that I will just have a few moments of meditation while I talk to the gods, talk to the goddesses, and make my peace. Okay, back home. Didn't quite go as I planned. Um, There's quite a few people, well, so quite a few people, five people in two different uh, groups came and went one of which knew where the circle was because it's like half buried by grass and then some other guys that came and uh, they didn't know where it was because it's it's kind of hard to find it so I was quite pleased that I was able to um, show them where the the stone circle was in the grass um, and it made their trip up here worthwhile knowing that they'd found it it's actually taken me about three years to find it myself because where is it how do you know what's the difference between what's a natural structure in the ground and what has been placed there but um i found it in the end so uh yeah that's great okay the sun is setting it's quite low now on the horizon and uh yeah, I should um, head back off to the uh, to the car. Won't take me long. Twenty minutes.